Hey everyone, and welcome to Commander Clash, the season finale, which we're doing as a homage to Richard, who will be leaving the crew, the core crew at the very least. He might be popping back now and then as a guest appearance, but we're going to have a core shakeup, and this is the last episode with this crew intact. So each of us have built a deck based around what we feel best embodies Richard's playstyle or just a any sort of homage to Richard in general. So let's start it off with Seth. What are you running? All right, so when I think of Richard Dex, the main thing that comes to mind is some sort of crappy tribal deck that somehow does really well. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> underdog. How about underdog? Underdog, tribal? okay. Let's... <laughs> Underrepresented. <laughs> Underrepresented. Uh, so when I decided to build a Richard deck, I literally did a search by the various tribes in Magic and tried to find the worst one possible that had a legendary creature and also enough creatures to make a tribal deck. And I ended up with Shade Tribal. So <laughs> this might be the first Shade Tribal deck in the history of Magic. Uh, I have a legend, which was one of the requirements. Uh, Ishin Shade, back from Homelands, I think, originally. <laughs> so hopefully you're not playing a white deck or you're going to have a hard time beating my six mana 5-5 five, five with protection from white. Uh -oh. uh, but basically, I got lots of shades and ways to hopefully make a lot of mana so I can pump my shades many times and hopefully kill you with them. <laughs> that is awesome. And it's a five turn clock, so that's, oh, or even a four turn clock if you have any sort of pump with a shade effect, perhaps. <laughs> <laughs> so that's going to be pretty sweet. Uh, how about you, Tom? What are you running? So, um, I was researching about Richard because it's a, it's a whole entire deck, a bunch of decks, in homage to Richard, as you said. And I found out a long time ago uh, that Richard was actually a knight for a very long time. Uh, he went by Sir Richard. And um, <laughs> I really found this out uh, by utilizing uh, Matilda Kanda Truthseeker, who really did a lot of the dirty work for me, which is wonderful. So um, a lot of these cards are just kind of little pinpointed times from Richard's past that I thought I'd bring to light. Uh, before we send him uh, to the next step. Well, this is going to be enlightening. We're going to have the biography of Richard as told by Tom's deck. <laughs> That's 100% true and 100% factual. I the guarantee it. The legend of Sir Richard. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> That's amazing. All right. I'm going to leave Richard for last. I'm going to describe my deck. This is Tomer. I am running a deck based off one of Richard's previous decks that he made. Uh, during the Halloween special, he ran a spooky skeleton tribal deck where every single card was featuring a skeleton or bone, something related in the card art or the name or the type. And it didn't perform, it didn't get to show off all the goodness because unfortunately it was taken out early in the game. So I decided to take that theme back, do the whole thing where every non-line card must be featuring a skeleton in the name or the art or the type. And I'm going to be running, instead of the mirror, the skeleton ship that Richard was doing, I decided to branch out and do it a little bit different with Golgari. Unfortunately, there's no skeleton in Golgari, uh, skeleton leader in Golgari, but I did pick Marin of Clan Neltoth, who has a cool spooky skeleton glowing skull in her hand. So hopefully that's good enough. And the deck is really bad, but... Um, because I figured I'm not going to be doing too much in Dirtling, I do have a, a ton of skeleton puns to entertain you with. <laughs> I have a skeleton of them, and some of them oh are, very, are very humorous. <laughs> oh, no. Yes. Yeah, yes. You're, you're killing me, Tomer. <laughs> yes, I, I thought I prepared the most for today's episode, but I was wrong. <laughs> so I'm going to be sitting back, Dirtling, hopefully regenerating and, and charming you with the puns. <laughs> <laughs> All right, last but not least, Richard, what are you running on Richard Week? So apparently Tom found me out that I was once a knight in my former life. So I actually went knight tribal. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and it was actually based on uh, the the uh, the three to cast two to suspend knight that Tom played the other day. Uh, it was a super sweet the one that comes with the black knight token. So I thought, why not knight tribal? There are a ton of knights in Magic. <laughs> 
Uh, they're all two twos, but it's okay. We're, we're playing Janky Tribal this week, and uh, I'm using the new uh, Cedar Condo of Jamura, which conveniently enough powers up your weenie creatures. So, oh. so it goes well with the knights. He's like an unofficial knight leader. Neat. Uh, he, he is a knight himself, so he yeah. is the knight leader. <laughs> Well, it, that, it's that's official. Cool. That, that's true. Too. <laughs> but it doesn't say knights you control get blah blah blah. It's just creatures power two or less are, are a little bit better with them. And it just so happens that the knights are power two or less. Ah, I thought that was cool. Whatever. Unfortunately, <laughs> I'm playing mono white, splashing green for my commander. So Seth's, uh, Seth's shade just hard <laughs> counters my entire deck. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. And and for Tomer, most of my shades or many of them have swamp walk, so I just have like the meta deck for, the, for I know. this week. Oh, my skeletons, all they do is they regenerate. That's all. <laughs> that's all they do. <laughs> all right, starting hands. I'm going to keep this hand before I time out and draw. I have two lands, and it seems fine. Yeah, I mean, I got lands and a shade. So my deck is full of two drops, yet I have none in my hand, but I'll keep anyway. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, so I get to start off uh, the game Ooh. with utilizing the F8 key, which I learned about a long time ago. <laughs> was actually originally sponsored by Richard's clan. Uh, <laughs> they were known as the clan of fate, um, and they would always really propel the idea of utilizing F8 every single turn. Do you remember what that does, Richard? It was your crest, after all. <laughs> I, I actually don't know. I've, I've somehow slept through 50 episodes of Commander <laughs> without knowing what F8 does. Uh, Tom, can you explain? <laughs> a little refresher, please. Oh, of course. As long as your lands are tapped and you can't activate abilities for zero or less, uh, you just get to all yield the turn. You're going to see us tap out a lot, not cast anything. That's just to speed up the, uh, the, the game itself. Hmm. Nice. A little heads up for everybody, the more you know. Speaking of speeding up the game, uh, the first thing that I'm just going to bring a representation into uh, was Richard's old flame. Uh, she ended up being queen, queen of land, or sovereign, if you will. And the only thing was she was just really harsh with everybody, and no one was really a big fan of her. Uh, but overall, she definitely did some work. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, there's a whole thing behind every single one. Tom's so got get a ready. for the entire deck. <laughs> right, I, I want to more. draw his, his deck here. <laughs> this is either going to cause me to live longer in this game or die a lot quicker. <laughs> now, I'm not sure which one. This is the saddest white weenie start I've ever seen. <laughs> Pass. I think it depends how good the story goes or how bad the story goes. So, oh, okay. of course, the Scepter of Empires was really important for Richard's family. Uh, they started off as, a, as an empire, if you didn't know, then consolidated into a single castle. Uh, but I feel like I should probably attack the mono-white person first. Sorry, the mono-black player first. I'm not the mono-black player first. What? <laughs> yeah, it's fine. <laughs> Boo. All right. Uh... The, get, get in there before your skeletons come down and blank his entire I office. I don't even have skeletons You're not wrong. around. <laughs> I'm just Why gonna, am I at 39? I'm just going to play I, I tapped you with the Scepter of Empires. Oh, that's what's happening. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's what that, that's what that does. <laughs> a slut, a slut, a slut. I didn't even bother to read it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a 40-turn clock. Watch out. Oh. Hey, we that's... can play real cards? What is this? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm playing a new card. Oh. A life crafters bestiary help my uh, white weenie card advantage. Oh, that card's so good. Whenever a source you control deals damage. Hmm. How do we beat also that? Quite nice. <laughs> Can't actually beat that card. I guess, I don't I guess you just kill it over and over. And not attack Tom. <laughs> wow, <laughs> I'm getting the aggro on me. Oof. That's what happened the first time I played that deck. I think I just like randomly died on turn four. <laughs> I, like doing nothing. Someone just attacked me and I died. Yeah, I remember that. Was, uh, who? What monster did that? I don't know. <laughs> so I guess I have a question for Tom. Yeah. What did the nurse say to the injured skeleton? What is that? <laughs> You're going to be a K. Okay. Tibia. What? Okay. 
Oh, oh no! Oh, okay. no! Oh no! Oh no! It's terrible. Yes. So bad. Yay! So bad. Oh, why? <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm, I know who I'm attacking next turn. Aw. <laughs> but I got more. <laughs> oh, man. Ooh. Hey, look, it's magnifying glass. Oh, man, I'm doing so little. Was that one of our preview cards or no? Uh, I think that was our first preview card. No, Sears Lantern was. Sears oh, there was Sears. Lantern. They're, Sears. they're similar. Mm. Oh, I really want this card, even though I can't cast it or do anything useful with it. I'll keep it. <laughs> yeah, like, greed. Ultimate greed is good. All right. Uh, first night comes down. Oh boy. Ooh, that's Ooh. one of the best ones. Wow, indestructible. What? How the entire archetype happens comes down. <laughs> <laughs> well, the good news is that along with the throne, there as long along with the scepter, there's oh. a Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. No it's tutors, beautiful. no nothing. Just right this off the This is the, the next cauldron. What is this? <laughs> so what's the story behind the throne of empires? Well, as I mentioned before, uh, when it came to Richard's family, as uh, Machoka Kano Tooth Seeker told me, my PI in this situation. Uh, they were first an empire before they ended up consolidating into a single united kingdom, which was very important. Mm. Indeed. All was right. this throne set originally printed in M12? It was. Huh, how come I don't even know that this exists? <laughs> mm. All right, Richard, I have a question for you, Aquarius. Oh, if you man. <laughs> Uh, why can't skeletons play church music? I don't know, Tover, why. I know, I know this one. Because, I know this one. Because they have no organs. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was so good. <laughs> Much better than the, uh, <laughs> the previous joke. Oh, we gotta kill Tomer first. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna pun my, out, my way out, guys. I'm gonna punt my way out, but pun, pun, pun. <laughs> Oh, I gotta look at my deck for a second. <laughs> Do I have... This situation's kind of scary. What's so scary about this situation? Everyone has creatures and they're attacking me with them. One, two, three, four. You can almost cast your commander. It has pro-white. <laughs> uh, yeah, but it's gonna be tapped. Let's just... Uh, Are you wrapping the board? Get the, get the first shade down. <laughs> nice. The Crypt Ripper. It has haste, but is unfortunately tapped. And then I figured tutors were okay because Richard always played tutors. It's fair. It's not increasing ambition. Yes. You're doing it wrong. Yeah, it has to be increasing <laughs> ambition. I'm sorry. I was going to say, Seth is like slightly blaming Richard for playing tutors right now. <laughs> like, oh, yeah, he did this, so this is fine. But of course you can play tutors. I mean, it's, it's EDH. Play whatever you'd like. That's the point. You just don't attack me because you'll have to sacrifice a permanent. <laughs> that thing is really good. Especially because I just have all jank cards and can't properly deal with her. I know what you mean. So I wanted to cast my commander and use the Lifecrafter's Bestiary, but mm. unfortunately, no. Uh, we'll just pass. <laughs> I really like the art on that Pearl Medallion. Yeah. Nice. It looks steampunkish. So if there's one thing I know about knights, it's that they always keep to their vows. Oh, yes, beauty. <laughs> That's beautiful. Ooh, it's coming on my creature. Yeah, I, I don't really want to be attacked by that right now. Ouch! No. Oh, he's just one more. Empire thing away. Yeah, and then I, I kind of want that crazy. to happen. <laughs> what's what's the last one do? I don't even remember. Does it matter? He makes like five <laughs> tokens every turn. <laughs> lightning bolt someone. Create five of those tokens. Yikes! Ah, I'm not attacked much this time. Artifact removal. I have. Tom is actually going off here. <laughs> What is this? 
All right, this might end up biting me, but I think it's also going to be pretty funny. Uh, but first, I have a question, Rich. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Why was the skull single, Richard? Why was the skull single? I don't know, it's Homer. You tell me. Because it has no body. Oh, man. Oh, man. Well, I don't get the joke. Oh, because oh, it's a single as in a relationship. <laughs> and no body because it's a head. And ah, yeah. yeah. God, God. <laughs> okay, so Flesh Bag Marauder. I picked this oh, art God. particular because in the background, you see all those like land masses around the water. It's actually all skeletons. Ooh, spooky. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and I, I get triggers, and things happen. Huzzah. Oh, and I get something under my mimic fat. Yeah. That's why I was like, should I? Shouldn't I? <laughs> yeah, I figured. <laughs> that seems like the best of the options. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty good. I get a counter... And I make a token. And do, do, do. I think I'll just play another swamp, not do anything else. Uh, do I attack? I guess I will attack. Actually, yeah, no. Yes, no, no. OK. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there. <laughs> All right, let's let's do this. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Whoa. Nice! Wow! <laughs> wow. <laughs> I do that. not approve of any of this. That is classy. That was insane. <laughs> yeah, I, that's uh, the maximum value. Oh, I, I'm tired of my shades coming to play tap, Tom. I blame you. Do I still get the experience counters, or is she already out of the battlefield, so therefore nope, no? You probably. do. You got three. Oh. Or you have three total. Does it say anywhere? It doesn't say yeah, on my... on your... Well, it shows it on my screen. Oh. By your... Oh, yeah. Cool. Sweet. Wait, oh, what's that... under the mimic bat? How can I tell? The flesh bag uh... marauder, which is hiding underneath my swamp. <laughs> Obviously, oh. <laughs> can't you tell? <laughs> uh, I'm going to yeah, just tap out. <laughs> Utilize that FA key, as Tom already mentioned. Oh, come on. Where are all my knights? Oh, here we go. Right there, One, actually. two, three. Oh, wait. I have a pro medallion. Did it wrong. Ooh. Boom. <laughs> Attended knight. And you have the green. Nice. Well, we got an herb orc. That's nice, too. And that's it. I did put a lot of mana acceleration in my deck because it's all two drops and they're white, white. But it's coming back to bite me. Uh -oh. Uh -oh, no more attitude. attacking Tom. Again. Uh, what is this? All right. <laughs> uh, I think I'm just going to play Marin again. That seems fine. What does she do again? End step, choose. Uh, oh, it's less than. Uh, yeah, you don't have enough yet. Uh, uh, mimic that's so annoying. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I guess I will just go. One, two, three, four. Diabolic Tutor. And I see the uh, skeleton, the skull, the Diabolic Tutor there. Yep. I, I, had to, I explicitly asked for that version <laughs> of R from, from Seth, so I made like a lot of custom requests. Uh, nah. Oh, this is all so bad. <laughs> I have to have an answer of some kind. What do you need to answer? 
Well, I want to play Mimic creatures, Vat. but Mimic Vat's like really annoying. I guess I could maybe just get like. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Uh, I know the viewers know what I should get, but that can't help me right now. <laughs> uh, that would be a pretty sweet. Uh... Go greedy. Yeah. All right. Um, did, did you tutor for increasing ambition? Because that's what I would do. No. <laughs> oh. Twelve oh. offers. Which is pretty good. That's, that's pretty good. Yeah. Um, ooh, that's so much mana. Bone horde. Ooh. Oh gosh. <laughs> one of my only, <laughs> one of my only legitimate threats. Behold the four four. <laughs> <laughs> Gaze upon its majesty. This bone horde dying. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Unless Not yet. he's going to play something. Oh, I'm going to play something. It's going to be a shade. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Off shade. Uh, only three mana to pump. <laughs> <laughs> this one's like strictly worse. <laughs> Normally a shade is one mana for plus one plus one, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right. What does my bestiary show me? Uh, I'll take it. Chieftain Andal. His <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh. name makes it sound like he should have shadow or something, but he doesn't. He's just a, a human knight. I think those are like Ilkor and Doffy. Yeah. And like on Vec right. or something. The obscure oh, finally. lore references. Alright, that was the best draw ever because now I have a green source, another one. <laughs> so I can cast my commander and draw a card. Going off there. Ooh, do I have... Okay. Starting to get some devotion going. Because we all play dirtily creatures, we can't attack. <laughs> <laughs> yes, okay. Oh, oh, oh boy. Eight mana. Did you find the the crown of empires. No, I found the sword of your clan. The sword of the chosen. <laughs> oh my goodness. I mean, what else? Is getting huge. Wait, it's not even an equipment. Nope. <laughs> you just have to make it it's even better. <laughs> you can use it as a political card. Wow. Yeah, it's any legendary creature. I can buff all the legends right now. I mean, but it is your family's sword, so I'm just going to let. That's Stay hilarious. Up. I didn't know there were swords that were not equipment. I think I have enough. What is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Your skeleton should cost two mana, Tomer. <laughs> Why do you need eight mana? <laughs> Something suspicious is happening. <laughs> nothing. Nothing spooky or sinister is happening. Um... Let's play this. Let's play. Whoop. Marin's coming back. And I have another question for you, Richard. Oh, God. <laughs> what is the Richard? What, what is the <laughs> skeleton's favorite weapon? The bow and marrow. Oh I was really hoping it was just going to be bone saw, but yeah, I was going right. to say bone saw. <laughs> bone saw. Bone saw. And then I will play probably the best. Yeah, this is actually the best skeleton in the deck, bar none. The Golgari Grave Troll. Oh, that's actually oh, a skeleton. It's a that's skeleton. A skeleton. It's a troll skeleton. It's a 1-1. One, one. Also a 1-1. One, one. <laughs> you know what? It's, it's getting there, okay? It tries. <laughs> the, bar, the bar is low for best skeleton in the deck. The 5 minute 1-1 one, one takes not, it home. It's not the size that counts. It's the utility, okay? And it's a troll skeleton. How many troll oh. skeletons do you ever see? None. <laughs> Came it's like all the, the way from modern to show up as a 1-1. One, one. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh. Uh, Get some experience wait. counters. I sh you have three. I, I should probably let this resolve first. Ah, boo. You're no fun. <laughs> you got me. <laughs> now we can do this. 
Ah, it's fine. Yeah, yes. soldier. If you did he it on before Tom's turn, you could have killed Michiko again. Uh, he left the sword up, or the, the throne up the whole time. Oh, I was you waiting. Could, could have done it in response. Well, I actually should have done it before his turn, and then there's a there's a whole order of operations. I actually am the one that messed up the most here. Yeah, punts all around. Remember this, YouTube comments. Punts all around. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, are you going to let him exile the Gugari Dream Troll right now? What? But what? I don't really want it. Alright. It just, it's just like I a would big think Seth would prefer fight. the repeatable uh, edict effect. <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, yeah, Underworld Connections, that's a thing. I prefer the repeatable card draw effect. That's, uh, that's also a thing. Alright, let's 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 pass the turn. So I guess it's up to me to kill that Mimic Vat, huh? I'm not <laughs> adverse to it at all. Well, the question is, Richard, how many spooky skeleton uh, <laughs> artifact removals do you think of packing? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I can tell boy. you have none in hand, so... <laughs> you can, like, just putrefy, probably? <laughs> Is that really scarier than the scepter throne combo? Yeah. I, it's a 1 in 84 chance I'm able to find the other part of this. <laughs> well, you already found two. I know! I felt So you're ahead really of the curve. <laughs> this is the weirdest card. I have to reread your commander every single time. Because <laughs> <laughs> his text makes no sense every single time I see it. It just does five different things. It's weird. I'm so sad that everybody has ways to get around my army of drudge skeletons. Like, their only purpose in this <laughs> deck is to block. <laughs> you have protection from white commander. You have that all your creatures are now evasive. Michiko's just Michiko. All right. Now we can do this. Oh, goodness. Yeah, I'm going to keep tapping you if you keep doing this. <laughs> yes. I, well, just stop casting your commander and we can have a truce. Not my germ. <laughs> no? Uh, you can sacrifice your, your commander. Uh, no. <laughs> the germ is fine. Would you like to take the germ, Seth? <laughs> oh, no, Please. you can't. It has to actually go to the graveyard. <laughs> yeah. Oh, what what did he take? Uh, the attendant the knight. Oh, Wait, what? really? What? Yeah. What attended the token maker? Yeah, so I get a one one every turn. Oh, okay. That's like a bitter blossom. Right. Hey, Tom and I are friends. Yeah, this is what Celestial is... Crusader pumping my team. What is it? Says, see, <laughs> see, they always seem up against us. This is <laughs> actual proof. Oh, oh my goodness! My God. Oh my god! <laughs> Whoa there! Easy. So oh, no. I found That's... the other combo in this deck, which is Richard's great ancestor, the Celestial Crusader, with his spectral cow, which is wonderful. Remember that so Fleshbag Marauder? Remember that? that... Yeah, remember that Fleshbag Marauder? Uh, uh, that, just, uh... just you got to have removal, right, Tomer? <laughs> All right, <laughs> skeleton removal. Yeah. <laughs> there All right, is skeleton removal, but. <laughs> Sweet. I remember this. All right. Hit. If Tom gets another hit, he goes yeah, to 60. Wow. We can't really let that hit again. Well, I'm giving, you, I'm giving you another chance at uh, correcting that mistake because I'm going to get the Marauder back. But then Ooh. I'll have to sack my shade. Or need oh, God. Sacrifice There's the an extinction Marauder. in there? Wait, what is this temporary? Uh, is that was my trump card. <laughs> <laughs> why, why are all these cards revealed? Uh, that's the dredge, I think. Dredge. Oh, that's the dredge. Okay. Okay. Uh, so what do we do here? Wait, is it your hand at the end step? I think I'm just going to oh, replay. Some really good cards. I'm just going to replay some of my stuff, I guess. All right, Seth. If I bring back the Marauder, then you can get it with the Mimic Vat. All right, I'll give up on Bitter Blossom. <laughs> Bitter Blossom. Oh. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's one, two. Oh, so much mana. Oh, wait, no. Wait, how are you bringing back the Marauder? With Aaron's just, ability. Just a... But that's the beginning of your end step, right? Yeah, yeah. 
but then I do it. Oh, it goes Seth, right to the battlefield. And that gets rid yeah. of yeah. token number one, and then Seth can get rid of the Celestial Crusader. Wait, but my army. <laughs> That's what I'm you saying. Lose two, you lose a Knight of the White Orchid I, and a Chieftain. You're fine. I worked really hard for this. <laughs> I don't know if I can deal with an Edict effect every single turn. You're at 80 know. life. You'll figure it out in time. <laughs> I don't know that I have anything to deal with it either. Also, this Marin deck is about to go. Already going off, actually. Well, Gary, uh, welcome yeah, to the, the trolls. Oh, uh, Richard, I have another question for you. What do you call oh, a skeleton who presses the doorbell? A dead ringer. Oh, Lord, hey! you stop. Will you stop? No. Will you stop? No. <laughs> Take a damage. No, I will. Thank you, but I have another. I mean, sure, later, I guess. Oh god! Uh, and then one, two, three. How much is this? Oh my goodness! You should be fine. We have so much. Oh, mana. it's only two. Uh, I was like, ah, four. What? Silly. Um, put it on you. Actually, let's let's start chipping. There's nothing. <laughs> yeah. Might want to hit the guy with eighty. Yeah, yeah, that's that's, that's where I'm going at. The person who got me down to twenty eight already. Hey, that's nine commander damage. I know. Yeah, the next Mary, hit will kill him. Merit's coming yeah, with the I bone really, horde. Really, really want to put it out there that we should not just let Tomer win the game with the skeletons. <laughs> with your commander. Yeah, the commander's basic. That's why I picked her. Was that the deck is horrible? Is she... So I wanted to take something good. She's card advantage. She's sweet. She's up Alright, let's and this comes back. Let's get that Maruder back. So I did all I can, so I'm gonna have to leave this in your guys' hands, okay? Mm, do I just get rid of the grave troll? Yeah. Grave troll. You can take it, I'm fine with that. Uh Hey, you, know, you, could, you could keep the attendant if you want. You can make, keep making uh, tokens. You can take the grave troll. What else died? Mm -hmm. The first strike thing. <laughs> <laughs> I probably don't want that. Oh. Uh, uh. Celestial Crusader. <laughs> <laughs> uh, also not exciting. Why don't you guys play good creatures? That was my downfall, putting them in the, that in the, hey in the deck in bad tribal week. Sifter weed. of Skulls. Flashback Marauder. These are good cards. You so haven't even seen my you haven't even seen like my ten Drudge Skeleton copies. They're just literally just two mana one ones with regenerate. <laughs> we got all of them. Uh, is this what we gotta do? Oh, it feels so bad. Are you wiping the board again? Are you casting your commander. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's draw a card first. Uh, play this. Do you have spell mastery? Uh, I believe so. Oh, nice. Tutor and hex. <laughs> Maximum value. And what are we getting? I guess a board wipe, but then I'd be sad. And we're friends, right, Seth? Yeah, we're friends, Tomer. Remember like I, always. Remember, remember <laughs> that uh, Underworld Connections that I have a strip mine for, but I'm not using because we're friends. <laughs> <laughs> and there was silence. Don't I, kill! I, I, don't don't kill that! I have a strip mine too, and I'll strip mine your cabal coffers. Oh no! All right, we're friends. I'll kill you last. I promise. All right. Ooh, good this enough. is the best shade, right? This has to be the best shade. It, it was, I have an extra uh, mana, so it was we'll, we'll standard start doing same things. Then. I actually have seen people try in modern. Their decks weren't good, but people try sometimes. <laughs> It is the best shade, but then again, it's still a shade. <laughs> uh, that was not a creature. Mm -hmm. So my free card draw train has come to an end. And call in the allied reinforcements. <laughs> nice. They're not only knights, they're allies. The bow of Nihilia. Oh, okay. Get a little combo going here, creatures attacking have creatures. Touch. Get death touch. Where are my regenerate skeletons? What is this? <laughs> <laughs> Knights have first strike, making that a, a good combo. Oh dear. 
Oh, I need to block. How do I make progress on this board? <laughs> if you send your commander at Tomer, I'll make sure to knight him. Ouch! <laughs> what I am I going to block with comes back? I don't like any Just of the, this. The everything else. We'll hit Tomer then. Oh, no. I'm going to wait until blocks, because if I don't... If I do it beforehand, he can block it. This, this is... card is so weird. Wait, what? Why it's... can't you... Oh, I see. Now I can. Because now he has four power, and he could be blocked now. Richard, we're friends, though. Magic's a really weird game. That's all I, That's all I got. All right. Oh! Oh, never mind. Richard, your family saved me. <laughs> uh oh, are you wrapping I forgot board? about the act of authority you guys had. Uh, Ooh. uh oh. Oh, no. Oh, wait, so we can just keep passing this thing around? <laughs> if I so choose. Oh, no. That's not what are you, good. What, what are you exiling there, Tom? Is he the uh, bone horde or the mimic bat? Uh, okay. Definitely the dredged player's bone horde. <laughs> Boo. <laughs> I like that answer. My bitter blossom lives another turn. <sighs> All right. Yes, I will keep dredging. Thank you. Skulltap, Urborg, Golgari, Bone Dancer, Boneyard Worm. Good stuff. How big right. is that? Oh, he's 4-4. Four, four. Uh, is there anything that works well here? Not really. I, I, I guess this kind... No... That would not be nice for me right now. Okay, uh, let me just make a lot of mana. As is tradition. Uh, I really need a strip mine. <laughs> like the one I have? <laughs> uh, the Grave Troll returns. Huzzah. I didn't put it in this deck because your family was very anti-mining, anti actually. <laughs> <laughs> They were very much hunter gatherers. They really disliked the land in general. Uh, that's one one. Well, I have, I have a pretty sweet skeletal card uh, that I picked up from Richard's original list. Most of the deck is from Richard's original list, but um, yeah, let's play. Grafted exoskeleton. Oh, no. oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> <laughs> It was a Richard deck. This is a Richard card. I'm sorry. Oh, it has no. never been more correct to kill Tomer right now. <laughs> but first, I have a question. What did the yeah. skeletons say when an army invaded his country? What? We're boned. And now that I wasn't attack. even. That wasn't even. <laughs> <laughs> that was the worst possible. And now I'm attacking. Uh, oh, let me. Please just put this guy on. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> on him. Oh lord. Boop. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, crafted. Did any? Did either of you have artifact removal? I know. I guess Tom has. I mean, I'm authority. I'm giving him a act of authority next turn. I'll tell you that. <laughs> I'll take That's it. That's probably probably a good call. And attack me, Tomer. <laughs> no thanks. <laughs> Back. And... I want to give value out of this mimic fat so badly. Attack. And. Ch ch chipping away. All right. <laughs> chipping away. You just dealt half his infect life. <laughs> <laughs> Almost. No, no. He has a he has a token. Oh yeah, using that token. <laughs> I would imagine so. Yes. The one thing I hate more than playing Infect is losing to Infect. <laughs> so I'm going to try my best not to have that happen this game. And put that there and feel better about myself. Hmm. Self-righteousness. It's delicious. Oh. And... What do, I, do I get a skeleton? That's right. I get a... Ooh. He doesn't have a sack outlet, right? Or does he? No. 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 Not on the battlefield. Uh, da, 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 da. I guess there's nothing really 
good to take from people, so I'm just going to get a boneyard worm. Wait, you can take from other people? What? I'm thinking about bone dancer. Oh. No, no boneyard worm. Oh, no, those are my knights. <laughs> oh. You Bone have like, yard worm. more knights oh. than... I thought it was going to be bigger than it actually was. Oh, well. Funnily enough, attended knight into the decks tonight. And Don't... only played by three different players. Eight Don't there. worry, everyone. I'm going to save us. So last turn when I tutored, I had a hard choice. I knew I needed to wipe the board. Also really wanted to draw cards. So I figured, <laughs> oh. why not do both? Oh. oh. Okay, I don't have a sack outlet. Can I do anything else? Nope. Seth, we were friends. <laughs> we we still are. I'm giving you tons of Eldrazi scions. This is, this is somewhat true, yes. <laughs> I've got nothing for this. <laughs> I, I, uh, uh, oh, Lord. Uh, All the triggers. Well, off they go, then. Are you taking his grave troll? <laughs> no, you gave him his grave troll back. I haven't I haven't got to do anything yet. Oh. All right. <laughs> no, not the face. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to prevent him from using greed later on. Yeah. <laughs> I can't hey, run greed. Got... There's no skill the no skill I tokens. checked. I probably well, his should commander take... doesn't go to the graveyard and other things. The Eldrazi didn't count. The uh, the token didn't count. Yeah. I have no idea what's going under Mimic Fad at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to take the Grave Troll so you can't have it. Go for it. But then your your Underworld Connections is gone, I'm afraid. Uh... <laughs> I know, it sucks. I mean, technically I have 16 cards in hand, so maybe yeah, it's okay. Drew your deck. <laughs> yeah, but... I would go with factually. You have 16 cards in hand. Yeah, but you're going to no discard and you're not going to draw more. Wow, okay, Tomer. Oh. All right, well, I got to do it, Tomer. I'm sorry. Uh, it hurts. Don't take. Don't hit my underworld connections. What did the foe do? What did he take? Grave troll. Ugh. Yeah, I can't let you have that. Oh, everyone has such bad creatures. <laughs> like, help me. <laughs> yep. <laughs> well, I guess we do this. Do that. Okay. So I can get my shades back. <laughs> Is it worth the two life, really? <laughs> Is it really? Uh, maybe. And now we discard. Uh, no tower? No, I have one somewhere, but I, I did not draw it. Under City Shade? <laughs> what is this Shade? art on Under City Shade? <laughs> it looks like a Saturday morning cartoon. <laughs> I'm discarding many shades. <laughs> oh, I love Liliana's Shade. Aw. Uh, Nightwing Shade. All of my favorite limited cards are going to the graveyard. <laughs> I, I can do, do it because I have Phyrexian Reclamation. I don't, yeah, but you can it. pump it without gate. It just yeah. double pumps with gates. Such oh my god. I need creatures. Cast the commander to draw a card. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Maybe I should have played the good old like 35 lander since my curve is pretty low. <laughs> Um, Even with all the scrying, you're still not finding creatures. I scry to the bottom, but then I scry <laughs> another land. All right. We'll do this. We're going to get some value by returning Temple of Plenty. Oh, my guy gets pumped. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Wow, it's like supercharged. <laughs> See? I have something in play. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Moto. Making me feel like I'm contributing. I appreciate it. <laughs> oh, I can't even attack because I don't want to take this poison damage. Oh, I'm getting rid of it. Oh, okay. Yeah, 100%. Boo. Also, your guy doesn't have haste, though. Oh, but if I... Oh, yeah, that's true. No, but if you get rid of it, he's going to then start killing my stuff. <laughs> well, if he kills your stuff, you get to trade it back. But he has nothing he has of value. Nothing goes everything else. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing of value left. I mean, I guess I, I mean, can get the underworld. Basically, connections. I'm going to get rid of the grafted exoskeleton, and I'm guessing the mimic back goes next. Uh, and then your grave troll will be gone forever. 
I mean, is it gone forever? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> yeah. Oh, this deck is something else. Oh man, that's a card I put in here, huh? All right. So, one of the greatest stories I heard about Richard's past and his ancestors uh, was that they used to have a dragon guard their fortress. <laughs> Specifically, one made of pearls and wrought with ivory. Uh, that's the pearl dragon. Mm-hmm. I used to play with this card. Right? All, all of the barrage dragons. I think there was a black one. What did that do? I think that was the best one, wasn't it? It must have been decent. Uh, there we go. Yeah, it's time. Sorry, Seth. Oh. I guess I could have used it for Cabal Coffers, but I have enough mana. The war has begun. Well, I said, if you were going to do that, I had to do that. I'm sorry. I I, I had to keep my word. I just got to find a tutor now to find my strip mine. Oh, man. <laughs> are are we going to do so preemptive begins. retribution? Goodbye, <laughs> throne. Really? Yep. <laughs> oh, he's are scared. You serious he's scared right of now? the crowd. I just I I need those one ones out of the way. The, there's the... a mimic vat and there's a fraction <laughs> reclamation in play. Well, now you can get rid of it now that I'm giving it back to you. Wait, why well, does he want to get I was rid always of the, attacking the, you the entire game. The that throw. made it really easy. Well, you were attacking <laughs> me regardless. Yeah. So. I mean, I guess the best way to get this to stop is just to kill you. <laughs> I think that was your game plan already, so I don't think I'm altering it that much. To be honest. Uh, Why does he want the one ones gone though? I'm confused. Well, first Tomer, of all, I didn't want him to assemble I the. Don't the understand any of that. And second, Tomer, of all, Tomer, assemb- Tomer assembles Caldra and then won't let anyone else assemble Caldra. <laughs> <laughs> He's the only one. I'm not even He's playing tutor it. effects to find it. <laughs> no, the mimic vat just does not bother me too much. What, what is under the mimic vat right now? The troll. Let's roll. Yeah. And I'm not getting it back if I remove it, too. I might get it back if it gets replaced, so. Boop. That's true. I'm kind of wasting my Mimic Vat on you not having that troll. Yeah, so you could get something better if you want. I might have to. At some point. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 22 more turns, never, over. Never stopping. <laughs> <laughs> never stopping. Uh, he can return anything to play every turn now. It. Yes. Hmm. Mm. <sighs> Someone's got to get rid of the Cabal Coffers, because then when we kill Marin, he won't be able to cast it again. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, do I get back? This is coming at me, I assume. Hmm. I guess I should stop holding on to this, because I'm just taking too much damage. Are you going to play a greed and draw five cards? <laughs> Flashback! Return! Oh. Wait, no! Why? <laughs> I'm killing my commander! <laughs> Why do you need a Flashback Marauder? Sorry, it does Richard. nothing! Uh, it does nothing on this board! Oh, I'm giving, no. I'm giving, uh, I'm giving Seth a chance to... to take something else that he might like more. Oh, you want your grave troll back? I see. No, just uh, you know, hmm. just offering it up, just making it a thing that you could have if you wanted. It's not that appealing. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Maybe next time. That's fair. And then I can't really block with anything. So what does this do? I think I'm going to attack Richard because he keeps attacking me. <laughs> I attacked you once, but That's I will keep attacking because you killed my knight like so many times. That's that true. Marauder was totally unnecessary. Preemptive measures, then. You killed a token on Tom's side. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going to get rid of the, the dragon, too. With what? Are yeah. you bringing Marauder back again? Yep. <laughs> oh my god, this is just as obnoxious as the Mimic Vat. <laughs> Probably more, I would say. Well, okay, how I... about this? You exile the Fleshbag Marauder on Tom's turn. He exiles the Mimic Vat with the Marauder on underneath. Uh, I'll, I'll offer just... it up. Uh, hmm. That's a fair trade, I would say. 
I don't I'm, know if I want to let you have Grave Troll. That's so <laughs> much. That might be worse. I'm putting it in your hands right now, Seth. You can exile the Fleshbag Marauder. There's no, no enchantments or artifacts on my side. Empty hand. Tom could I, just I exile the milk bag. We just gotta kill the coffers. The coffers is the. And then kill Mary. The oh no. <laughs> We can't uh, give him the grave troll before then. I also have coffers. Uh oh. <laughs> now these shades are like serious. <laughs> but I also have this. Ooh. Oh, dear. Tom, was there an Armageddon in my family's <laughs> history? <laughs> Pick black. No, there was no Armageddons in your family's history. I apologize. <laughs> so how much mana do I have? Oh, that dear. much. That's a lot. Can I <laughs> can I kill anyone? What? Is this like an like exsanguinate? Is no. A hasty shade? I have a hasty shade. Oh no. <laughs> Tover's at twenty two. I'm at twenty two. I have zero cards in hand, and my grafted exoskeleton and bone horde are both exiled. For good so reason. Mm-hmm. But I'm just saying. Alright, so I'm not Let's... quite as dominant of a position as I might have been. All right, let's let's uh let's do that. Get hasty shade. Oh no! What? What are you? <laughs> what? Where is it? What's it targeting? Oh, uh, hasty shade. Crypt, Crypt Ripper. We are friends, right? <laughs> yeah. We said we're we friends. Said we're friends. We did. That's true. You did just strip mine, my card draw. You, and you know just, how I feel about card draw. You did just exile a bunch of stuff of mine. See, my deck is doing its thing. It, it is again, pumping. I can... <laughs> oh, you can force him to block with Marin. Are you not scared? So, I don't think I you can could actually... attack actually the person at 75 life. I don't think I can actually kill you. How much damage can you do? You could just not attack me. That would be actually... wonderful. Where is Golgari Grave Troll? I should probably read that. What does this actually do? Grave I can't even find things. it. It's behind my jungle hollow. Oh, there's <laughs> a card back there? Yeah. No, it's behind the spawning pool. <laughs> uh, on my screen, it's behind the jungle hollow. It's just chilling. One, two, three, four, five. Ooh, that would be six? Maybe I, can I kill someone? What? Ten? <laughs> that someone is Tomer. <laughs> Every time. It's only I, I fitting can, I can the, give a creature plus one plus finale. one. I can give a creature plus one plus one. So I have so many more puns though. If I oh man, can I spend it? That would be eight, so it'd be fourteen plus Oh, but Tomer is a blocker, so I can't kill him. Just let him chump with you me. You could attack somebody who is not at twenty two life. Alright. Alright. <laughs> no, Hit, 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 kill the Marin. The problem is Marin, so I have to attack you, Tomer, because really? Marin is... Actually, no, I don't. I'll attack Tom since he has 75 life. I would oh. think so. <laughs> so nice. But this Marin gets a free spell every turn. Also, he's exiling really one of your things. And the Marin uh, keeps bringing back Fleshbag Marauder. <laughs> and it does. I literally can't cast any of my cards from now on. Well, I don't like getting back Fleshbag Marauder. I gave, I gave. But something. you still do. You keep. You're actually trying <laughs> but to you kill still me do. since the beginning of the game. You've been attacking me. I'm at 22 life. You had a dragon. Uh, what did you just reclaim? What do you want? You want me to just die? Oh, okay. <laughs> no, of course not. I'm just. It's okay. Like there's a reason why I have to get the deck of Marauder. I want to do other cool things. Trust me. Oh, Seth has like a million mana next turn. Are we I all have, dead? I have so many regenerating janky skeletons that I want to find. Oh man, the shades are doing it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I gave three life. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, planes to the bottom. No. <laughs> <laughs> what? It was a planes to the bottom, and then I drew another planes. Ah. <sighs> You're not going to exile my stuff, right, Tom? <laughs> How can I? <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> is wait, Tom wait. on mute? Is this no, 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 no. Tom is thinking. I mean, because <laughs> this... 
I he's the area isn't helping. If you don't if you don't exile my stuff, I can maybe kill Marin for you so you can cast stuff. And we're friends. So you wouldn't. Well, yeah, I guess you only have one card in hand, so you can't. Yeah, I'll see what I stuff. draw. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy. Am I, am I like just gonna die? Seth can just like one shot me, right? Uh, I don't think one, I have two, that three, much mana. Four, five, I don't six, think Seth is seven. is intending to go for you. It sounds like he wants to go for me still. No, Despite we're friends, our, our friends. We're friends. You just keep getting back that thing, and it's gonna kill all my shades every turn, <laughs> I and I can't kill anyone. Yep. I don't want to. I want to bring other stuff. But if like Tom brings out like something huge that's gonna that I can't block, then I'm going to like have a, to kill it. Like it's a going pearl for dragon, me. a pearl like dragon, a four four yes. flyer. What <laughs> I'm at, mark? What I'm at? Breathing? What I'm at? Twenty two never... life and the oh, four man, four and so everything is literally going for me. I have to. I'm sorry. <laughs> I've never seen anyone scared of a pearl dragon before. What I was at well, I know, forty <laughs> life, not so much. <laughs> He was just—he was just really scared of the tale of Richard's family. It's, you never know. That dragon oh, could become. Oh my god! My commander costs seven. An mana. elder dragon, and just <laughs> things get out of control. Ooh. We're gonna make some Eight. knight tokens. Oh. Make sure we make sure we don't die. Gain twelve. It does other things. <laughs> what is it? Oh, Exile no, enchantment. Like, real game life? enchantments that you want to get rid of. Yeah. Yeah. Probably just reclamation would have been a consideration. All I'm getting back is shades, though. All right, this Riders card. of Gavany, oh, really good this week, but doesn't really do much here. Don't choose I, shade. I think I gotta choose shades. Oh, okay. <laughs> Tober doesn't have any real skeletons. Like, come on. Yeah, we haven't seen a single <laughs> skeleton. Board. I've seen a lot of things with bones in it, but not an actual skeleton for the skeleton theme was, deck. I didn't say it was a skeletal tribal <laughs> deck. I just said every single card <laughs> has something skeletal about it. Uh, it's spooky skeletons all over again. Spooky skeletons. Uh, it's a shade, right? There's not a single lightning grease to be found. Well, I'm, I, I will say this is probably a Magic the Gathering first. Right at the Gavin, he just chose shade for a creature. <laughs> <laughs> so we should all be proud of what we've done today. <laughs> Shades are the most threatening thing on board. The worst part is he's not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> all right, yeah, let's get rid of that uh, gauntlet of power there, sir. Uh, oh, I kind of wanted that mana. Yeah, me too. You still have a ton of mana. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, that's hilarious. Uh, I'm just going to cast my commander and pass. I think she costs eight now. Jesus. <laughs> this is too much mana for a 2-2. Two, two. Oh, I was doubling all your mana too, you know. I didn't realize that. Oh, wait, what? Oh, yeah, man. Because everybody was This was the worst black. idea. Why did I do this? Because of Urborg. I didn't even Homer, know. take a damage. Oh, this is my fault. Oh my I didn't even goodness. realize that. Although I can't do anything with the mana. <laughs> uh, what to do? Hopefully I draw something. Well, you want to see... You want to see some skeletons. I do. So I have a question for you, Tom. Okay. <laughs> I'm all ears. Which have cartilage, not bone in them. What 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 does the skeleton tile his roof with? Just uh, a question. What what is the answer to that? With shingles. Oh. <laughs> yep. You're a terrible person. Just. <laughs> what, do I, what do I even do? All right, I'm gonna give it kicker, I guess. I don't want that. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, I guess we do kicker. Three, four. All right. Urborg skeleton. With, with what kicks. is this thing? He's kicked. He's kicked. This is a skeleton. You wanted it. This is what you wanted. <laughs> this are is not, amazing. Are you not this entertained? This is the worst kicker ever. <laughs> are you not entertained? I'm incredibly entertained. Are you kidding? <laughs> Have you seen this art? It's awesome. Um, no real blocks. What? What? Oh, not, what? Nothing. Like, what nope. did you exile this time? Didn't you? Don't you just still have the grave? Here? I think it's still the grave troll. Yeah. Okay. Um, you want to give me back my grave troll? I'll give you another. I'll give you the chance again. Please stop! Stop getting back flashback <laughs> water. But, but. <laughs> Jesus Christ. If you give me a 
You don't have anything good. Limb duels high guard. Maybe so you, I'll take you that. Give him the grave troll. Just, <laughs> yeah, you, just, you can gonna dredge his deck up. I can't. I can't give you the grave troll. You can do it once you kill the coffers. <laughs> or if I find <laughs> the box. What else do I get? There's like I can get another crappy. Get a sifter skulls. Nah, no, it only makes sense to get this. Yeah, it's probably correct. The YouTubes would not be happy any other way. <laughs> I'm not gonna be happy regardless, but you know. <laughs> Tom has the most expensive T2 in the history of Magic. <laughs> so glad I'm playing this fun deck. <laughs> Yay! Set, exile it. No, it doesn't do anything. <laughs> and you get a grave troll. I'm fine with this. Uh, does not hit Cabal Coffers, so we'll just keep it. Wait, are you killing my bow? Don't kill the bow. <laughs> no, I just gotta target something. Ooh. Oh, yeah, if you kill the bow, then the Mimic Rat dies. Probably not a good trade. What? Because uh, he, he gives me the active authority, right? <laughs> but it's supposed mm -hmm. to be passed around. All right, let's, let's think about this. Well, oops. Ooh. Party, party, party time. We party are, we're, time. We're gonna, we'll party. Probably not till the end of Tomer's turn, but no, uh, <laughs> party now. <laughs> uh, who's this hitting? Guy at sixty-nine life. Yeah. Pump. Just pump it all. Utilize that F eight key. I took two. <laughs> that was a bit anticlimactic. Okay. Uh, I guess we got to do this. Uh. Oh my god. That's that's not cool. Uh, do you have any dragons? <laughs> oh no! The, <laughs> the pearl dragon would have survived if not for the fleshback marauder. You, you won't take my skeleton. Kind of doing its thing now. Oh, the board wipes. Eventually, Marin's going to be so expensive you can't cast it even with <laughs> coffers. <laughs> That's the new goal, since I can't find the coffers. You have so many cards. It's not fair. <laughs> uh, you resolve one decree of pain. All right, let's, let's party now. Mm. Since I have ex extra mana. I don't like this party. <laughs> you, that's like a dredge one. Uh, oh, yes, yes, <laughs> creatures. No. Uh, <laughs> excellent. Uh, and then we'll just get this back. Oh yeah, that's a thing. Eventually, I have all the swamps out of my deck too, which is sweet. <laughs> Card advantage never ends. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Um, I don't want this card. Oh my god! All right, planes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, time to start the party. Oh, protect! Oh, order the white shield. That's bad. What is this? Man many of the older knights just randomly have protection from black. It's, it's not. It's not nice. And then we play the original. Oh no! White knight. <laughs> Everything has too. protection from black. Why do I have a feeling like all of this is going for me? And uh, we'll play Knight of Dawn. Oh, flexible <laughs> protection, protection from black, sorta. I get protection from anything, yeah. not just black. And since we don't have haste, we can't really do anything. So we'll just pass. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> knighthood. How do you think Sir Richard became Sir Richard? Through his knighthood. <laughs> also, the most and I will, I will now hit you forever, Tomer, because magically I drew oh. Crown of Empires. <laughs> oh. Oh, man. Gain control of a creature? <laughs> yep. That's a good thing you did that, Tomer. Yeah. 
In that's, hindsight, uh, at the time it was still dumb. <laughs> I said the mimic vat does not bother me. He's holding on to the troll anyway. So it was the correct call, I still think. Now it's still three mana. I see only a creature. <laughs> it also made my Fleshbag Marauder far more effective. And now I will use the card that I exiled. Huzzah. Sanatorium Skeleton returns. The combo with Gyre Reach Sanitarium. <laughs> Basically. It makes sense now. <laughs> It was all planned. <laughs> all right, I guess I guess she's back, ladies and gentlemen. How much does she cost now? Uh, I have a question first for you, Seth. Uh, yes, <laughs> why, why, Tomer. Why are skeletons terrible liars? Because everyone <laughs> can see right through them. <laughs> oh. Hey! Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Hey. So how much how much did she cost? <laughs> what? Uh, how much did Marin cost? Like uh ten? Was it all your coffers mana? Maybe. Why? <laughs> Just curious. Are you gonna get rid of it? Because I'll be sad. <laughs> and we were friends. <laughs> We're still friends, even if I get rid of it. I am. Yeah. I am mostly afraid of Richard's protection from from black everything that you should be also afraid of at twenty one life. <laughs> Especially since I got to activate this reclamation a couple times a turn. Uh, what do I get back? Uh, Richard, if I don't get back the fleshbag marauder, will you just not attack me with those knights? Mm. Olive branch. Olive what are you branch gonna here. bring back? Something that's not flashback marauder. All right, okay. I'll give you a turn of respite. Okay. I like I like to actually keep my creatures for one turn. <laughs> Fair. <laughs> I agree. Is this? Oh, are you investigating? <laughs> oh, 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 geez. <laughs> I look we, like you're taking a damage, Tomer. We're friends. <laughs> we, we still are. <laughs> you. <laughs> Literally going for the throat. <laughs> this is not any sort of friendship that I want to take part of. You guys have a very abusive friendship. It really like, is. At the beginning of every game, Tomer asks everyone if they're friends. They all kind of say yes, and then they turn out not to be his friend. Oh. It hurts. It really it hurts. Oh, um, like, going to be mad about yeah. that. But, like, you and Seth's relationship, I swear, goes back and forth every other turn. I don't remember, like, the, I don't remember the time that I've ever betrayed Seth, though. It's always, <laughs> it's always one side of the abuse over here. I, I don't Na name betray a time. people. Name a time where I said we're friends, and then, and then I, I went for your throat, Seth. <laughs> uh, Marin, though, Tomer. There's exceptions. It's the, the, I wasn't even going to get the Marauder back. <laughs> Look at my uh, skeletons. <laughs> I'm not exiling it. <laughs> Just in case. <laughs> Just in case. <laughs> Gotta get that value. Ooh, man, I need life. <sighs> okay. Well, play Swamp. Do this. Oh, I wish I had a way to gain life. Because. Oh, jeez. Uh, oh. Hey there, I big boy. Works well with <laughs> all of my black sources. Obviously. Combo. Um, I guess we draw cards. <laughs> of course. Wow. You're playing a Tomer over there. Oh, Seth and I are spirit tonight. animals when it comes to drawing <laughs> cards over all else. You're not going to attack me, are you, Richard? Do I need to wrath your board again? Are you drawing more <laughs> cards? Like, and <laughs> I, I'm the scary person. I have skeletons in my hand, a skeleton on the board, 20 life. I can't block Richard. <laughs> I have a Marin that costs basically my turn. Seth is sitting at seven cards, however... It, Infinite recursion as well with the reclamation. More mana than me. 
I'm also letting everyone loot, though. You're not doing that, Tomer. <laughs> he is letting us loot. You got me. <laughs> Man. Sanitarium skeleton, and it's it's all laid out. How did no yeah. one see the seating? <laughs> Look at that. It's such a good combo. Gorgeous. It's beautiful. And it went across sets, too. One's Elders Moon, one's... Other, other one. Tom's all the way down to 66. <laughs> Why oh, do you bother oh, attacking yeah. if you don't pump it? <laughs> what is the point? Sending a message. <laughs> a damage is a damage. It I, was ab- I was about to tap it for the record because I was worried about him attacking me. <laughs> and then turned out it wasn't an issue. I need my man to not die to Richard here. Oh. I could have what, helped you if that's What could you do with but, mana? Uh, Oh, make a grave troll to block. <laughs> so need to throw me under the bus. Yep. You don't have pro grave troll. Oh, oh, one, two, three, four, five. Do you have a strip mine still? In my deck. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, close. Here's a Maria. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's. Hmm. Is it is it time to consider what Richard's doing? Yeah, Richard's probably gonna win. No, guys, I'm still the number one you. threat, right? <laughs> yes, listen to Please, Tomer. <laughs> keep listen to keep Tomer. attacking me. I have a restless dead in a swamp in my hand. I am going off, folks. <laughs> <laughs> Just the problem like is, Merit. flashback marauder isn't like target person sacrifice a creature. You've killed all of my creatures. Every <laughs> single one. Yeah, There's Tom a reason I've attacked anything. you. The only reason why I've been doing it is because you've been attacking me non-stop <laughs> since the beginning of the game. And you it's weren't letting up. Cycle. But that was before uh, I even cast a Marauder. Oh, crack down. Oh, oh God. Uh, cracking down. Cracking down. Ha, it's actually kind of a combo with shades. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah it doesn't actually affect <laughs> It doesn't affect Tom. It's only for Tomer. It's great. It doesn't great. affect ske- real. It skeleton. doesn't affect. It doesn't affect my skeletons. They're not. Uh, they're not gonna do anything. Oh, but Seth has a wrath. He's gonna wrath my board, isn't he? Not if you don't attack me. It does seem like you kind of deserve it, though. Tom's at sixty-five. Just damn at sixty-five. He hasn't done anything in like five turns. But... <laughs> yeah. Uh. I just need life to draw cards, so don't attack <laughs> that's me. That's the scary part. You probably have some crazy yeah, spell. If he's got Erebos, he might have the whip of. All right, I'll, I'll just hit Tom for two. <laughs> I need these pro black guys for defense. Sending a message. Oh, no, is he killing my guy? Uh, I'm what? tapping him down. Oh, With the crown of your gosh. forefathers, I'm oh, tapping wow. him down. Can I do anything about this? No. Hope not. What is that? Is that... <laughs> is that uh... What's like the inner royalty kill? Regicide or something? It is. Regicide. This is regicide. This is deep Game of Thrones plots and, and assassinations. Mm, all right. I'm just pass. Tom's doing some. Ooh. <laughs> okay. That's big and flying. It's a. Three, three. I, my, my commander costs ten, so it'll never be a five, five, <laughs> <laughs> and it will also never have vigilance. So it yeah, does have first, first strike though, because it's a though, knight. Yeah? This this lady has been knighted. Oh boy! <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> He's back. <laughs> Can't really. Oh, jeez. Well, I got another swamp, and I'm gonna play Marin. Yo, uh, don't, don't do it, Tomer. Or what? You'll just keep killing just me. Just get back something anyway. else. I wanted oh, to. I was gonna you have so many cool cards in your graveyard. I wanted to bring back. Seriously, the, I was gonna bring that back. The Sifter Skulls. Remember that? Still and do. then, and then Seth decided, you know, just to kill it. I want it's to. It's still if, there, Tom. If, I can see it. If you don't attack me, it costs four. Tom, it's a four or three. Tom, that's not swinging at me. The angelic field marshal is not swinging at me. No, I got attacked for two by Richard. <laughs> that that means war. Okay. If, if you he's say, also at forty nine, and he's done. If you're not going to attack me, I'm not going to bring back the marauder. Boom. Yeah, deals these. Yeah. Okay, I'm bringing back this, uh, something else. Uh, you make all these premature plans about bringing stuff back. <laughs> What? Wow! <laughs> wow! Oh my God! I can't! I can't account for Seth. 
<laughs> Wait, what but do I you know have? Victim of night. What are you? What are you bringing back, Tomer? Sifter of skulls. What? What? What do I need permission for? What do you have in <laughs> hand? <laughs> well, remember what happened last turn. <laughs> Uh, are you going to attack me? No. You keep saying friends. I don't, I don't <laughs> okay. think you understand the word, <laughs> what, what that means, but I'm going to go for it. I mean, I, wa I want to advance my board state a bit. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. I, ho I hope you've, that's you've, all right. You've won, <laughs> you've won me over. I'm going to be a better friend, I promise. <laughs> oh. I've been hurt so many times, though. <laughs> but, but friends don't... <laughs> Play uh, your edict creature every turn with Marin. I'm not so even, how am I, just, I the unfriendly one? I just one? said I'm not going to. <laughs> Please don't hurt me. <laughs> not again. Uh, All right, Sanatorium Skeleton. It's coming out. <laughs> a okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, wrote, so I probably will not Doomblade that. It's a one two. Just leave it alone. I, I have no profitable attack, so I'm just going to ignore that. I'm surprised you keep that in your hand for sanitarium value. Oh, I have a, a lot of other junk to throw out. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you worry. Huh? Oh. All right. And Marin with the action. Boop. <sighs> All right. <laughs> All right. I gotta, I gotta... Why do you keep drawing cards? This is suspicious. You have six <sighs> cards at hand. Please, please do repay in kind. Please. They're mostly, they're mostly shades. Do what I could, I, could not have done. I believe that's how you built your deck. <laughs> uh, the good old Richard predicament. I can draw so many cards, <laughs> but they're all Kamigawa cards. <laughs> what do yeah, I do? They're all from Kamigawa. That, that is the Tomer predicament right now, too. I tried to. I learned from the best. I'm down to get my active authority back. Yeah, I, I don't think it's really worth it to exile that. Ah, you don't want to get rid of like the Lifecrafters Bestiary or the Night Crackdown. Crackdown <laughs> helps him. Bestiary. Crackdown. I think you should leave it alone. The Crackdown helps me too. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we're all gonna get a sandwich for like 30 sometime in the future so uh, I don't even think I have that in my deck I probably should well let's just play this uh oh no, no good can come out of this <laughs> oh he just has infinite mana he's fine don't what's, worry what's the, wor what's the worst that could happen <laughs> it's, only, it's only the third tutor don't worry <laughs> It better be increasing ambition, is all I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, it's all shades and wraths. That's what I figured. <laughs> I could get the strip mine. Oh no. <laughs> uh, oh, I have Bajukabog too. Then I could give Tomer back that. Oh my. Grave troll. This this word friendship just I I think I think it actually means in Seth's, Seth's like lexicon just enemy like hated enemy. So when we keep saying we're hated enemies, right, Seth? That's that that makes sense now. It oh, all man. makes sense now. I can draw so many cards. You could but you can bog me, but then I'm literally out of the game. Then and I'm dead. <laughs> uh, I don't. I have no idea what to do here. Oh, that gains me life. Okay, let's do that. What? You have life gain in your deck? Sort oh, are of. you gray merchanting? Uh-oh. <laughs> He's also got an Erebos, so no life gain for... Well, it's only relevant to me right now, but... Oh my god, 16 mana. <laughs> 6 Sanguinate, finish. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're gonna do this for a second. Okay. Wait, what? <laughs> oh no, what is this madness? Oh, Disciple of Bolas. <laughs> what? Disciple of Bolas? The thing where he sacks a creature, draws that many cards, oh. and gains that much life. Oh, that's that's silly. Can you can you attack Richard first if I tap down his only blocker? What, why are you doing that? He's about to gain 16 life and draw 16 <laughs> cards. Yeah, but I can't do anything about that, but I can do something about you blocking. But I, uh, yeah. I throw black to kill him. Well, I know Richard likes Condemn, though. He was talking about it on the podcast. If you condemn my Crypt Reaper... <laughs> Wait, that's good for you. You still gain 16 lives. I will be so sad. 
I'm I'm actually hoping for what's it called? Ah, Seth used it one time, and I was so proud. It's like a four mana instant. It does it does all the creatures attacking creatures damage back at itself? It's oh, hilarious! Yeah, I can't remember the name of it, but I know what you mean. Yeah. I hope you don't meet with your comeuppance. Hey. That's, hey. that's a that's a big old boy. Yeah. How do you even have enough mana to cast the it's thing? Grown boy. That's a all right. So yeah, I, I'll attack Richard first. Hope nothing that's goes horribly wrong. Big old wrong. boy. <laughs> Protection from black, but not protection from crowns or royalty. <laughs> okay. All right. But it so, doesn't untap, just so you know. Not yeah, well, not a, it'll, it'll not be a 1-1 one, one <laughs> or 2-2 two, yeah. two or whatever. So I put this card in my deck just uh, because I want to be able to call the deck Throwing Shade. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. So since Tom has the most life, and I don't I really, me life. and and me and Tom are friends, so I'm not gonna kill him. Cause... I have right of right of consumption. Oh, it doesn't draw you cards. This is just no. Straight. This is just straight nice... up 17 damage to the dome. This is the nicest I... right of consumption. It kind of draws me cards though, because it, it gains me life, and I have an Erebos. Yeah, I have no Ooh, response you're, there. You're now tapped out, I see. Yeah, so if you overrun me, you got me. <laughs> I will just uh, pump up my knight here. He's going to play some weird prophecy card that gives all of your creatures <laughs> plus one plus one free swamp your opponent's control or something. No, <laughs> We're just, all gonna die. just true conviction. That has to be the most classic <laughs> Richard card in existence. <laughs> true conviction... Pump up everything with your Nykthos and everything, and then kill me and Seth at the same time. That is the classic Richard move. Okay. Okay, we will... That's oh, also, no, also a classic okay. Richard card from Kithkin Tribal. <laughs> Kithkin Knight. <laughs> don't, don't think Kithkin would get neglected in this finale. I love that it's, it's, its mount is like a grasshopper sheep. A spring jack, if you will. Man, the lore was mm -hmm. awesome. So Seth's just gonna wrath the board the next turn, right? Is that what's gonna happen? I don't know. I can tell you what Seth is gonna do. He's gonna draw cards. I can't. <laughs> I no other, a lot of cards. There are no other variables I can speak of for sure, but. <laughs> Drawing do, you really cards think is <laughs> do you think I'd tutor up right of consumption if I wasn't going to use all that life to draw cards with air bows? <laughs> He's got to dig for his greed somehow. A lot of white mana. All right, we will draw four cards. Okay. Oh, all right, all right. Uh, play this thing. Oh, but Seth's just gonna wrath the board. How That's can I do anything not useful? Guaranteed. Oh, uh, you you definitely will. <laughs> this doesn't sound like draw cards. Those are different. <laughs> those are different words. Uh, but, uh, but you're at thirty-two as well. Hmm. All right, we will do this. Oh no. I'm so happy dead? about being at like a normal life total again. Yeah, I'm going to austere command, destroy all enchantments. What? Destroy all creatures with converted mana costs four or greater. Oh dear. Yeah, is that right? Yeah. Uh. Well, now I'm gonna wrath the board. <laughs> well, I know the board is gonna get wrath. Marin but we might as well uh, get her last hurrah. In. So dead, Marin. Poor Marin. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. I have nothing better to play. So my knighthood. No. Also, the only answer to Erebos. No. What? Only answer Act to Erebos. Oh, ah. Uh. Yeah. Well, the answer to Erevos is make sure Seth can't draw cards. That's true. He just hit him really hard. 
Uh, is that what's happening here? One, two. Do you really have true conviction? Does Maria go online? Is Maria already online? Five. Seven more planes. There's a canopy. Six. Yes. I think one short. Yeah. Is that going to be scary? Ah, there is! <laughs> oh my yeah. It's a Richard deck. Of course yeah. it's a true conviction. Come on. It's a Richard deck. Of course it's a true conviction. <sighs> Uh, my card drawing. Five, six, seven, eight, oh, nine. Oh man. Yeah, you're not dead, but oh, I'm I do so wish hard. one of those was like legendary, so I could give it plus four, plus four right now. <laughs> uh, we'll nice hit Seth. Of you. <laughs> you really want to help Richard? He has a Amaria that's going to be online like next next drop. He's drawing a bunch of cards. I think he's he's pretty much in a in a good position right now. And ye old pump on the night. <laughs> of course. What's the other one? It all gets first strike. Yes, of course. I think I'm all the way back down to where I started. <clears throat> and then oh. you'll rat the board. I was going to say, I'm just going <laughs> to go and pass here. Because I don't know if anything I do matters. Yeah. I did find your janitor, though. Maybe I he should. was written about a lot of the scrolls of your family. <laughs> <laughs> the janitor? Wait, where's the yeah janitor? the custodian? Oh, <laughs> oh the YouTube comments. <laughs> <laughs> well, I drew another swamp. That is good. Um, do you guys want to see the rest of my hand? Yeah, you do. All right. Restless Dad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there it is. That's a really cool art, actually. Yeah, it's sweet. I'm waiting for my flanking creature so that you can't even block. <laughs> Visions of Mirage had, like, a really cool, really cool artwork to it. I really hope they do that again. Like, go back to, to it. Um, I'm not going to play Marin because I'm actually a little <laughs> bit afraid that if you actually get rid of my Cabal Coffers, I'm just, yeah. Uh... Can you cast Marin still? I, I think so. With Cabal Coffers. I just... Don't I, do it because I probably really will wrath the board. Yeah. I'm right. not actually going to hit your Cabal Coffers. I'd probably kill Miri actually, if I found I'm, Strip Mine. I'm being as, as impartial as I can be. I have very little going on right now. <laughs> I have a Swamp in hand and my Graveyard. The worst I can do is get back a Fleshbag Marauder, which, let's be honest here, is not... That scary to anybody who's not Tom. All right, I am very scared of Fleshbag Marauder. That's a fact. <laughs> I just, I, I would love to be your friend. Oh, hey Ooh. there. I could be your Garrick. friend and Hello, never Garrick. bring that up again. Oh shoot, I forgot to say a pun. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Seth, before it's okay. You, before you do it, Seth. <laughs> yes, Tomer. <laughs> what do you call a highly educated skeleton? I don't know. A bona fide professional. <laughs> That's oh. not even a good pun. That's just using the word bona fide. Hey. <laughs> That's like, hey, hey, Seth, what do you call a really good stuntman? I didn't uh, say they were good I don't puns. know. To, uh, Tom. A bona fide stuntman. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good, though. <laughs> <sighs> uh, goodbye, Sanatorium Skeleton. Hey, you can get a skeleton. No, that's, that's okay. <laughs> you don't want to give me back my... I'm sticking with the grave troll for uh, the time being. I could, really, I could really use it to maybe find something going on. You know? I have the Tomer shade. <laughs> what? Oh, no. <laughs> that is Actually, cruel. everyone has swamps at the moment. Combo with Urborg. Yeah. Ooh. I, I have this shade that should not be in my deck. I, I can't was actually. By... <laughs> you can't <fuck> it. <laughs> but it is a shade. Everyone's shade. Shade. three mana one one. Oh, that's oh. interesting. Seth can actually that's a kill real people card, now. Actually. Yeah, I can. Well, he can kill people because of the Orborg. Yeah. I'm coming for you. I guess I'll probably have to tap the swamp walking one then. Question mark? Uh, hmm, no. All right, sounds good. 
<laughs> that was easy. All right. You haven't played uh, a card in a long time. I'm not really too worried about you at the moment. All right. <laughs> I meant that in a positive way. I, I, I know you did. And I received it in a positive way. Oh, I love this guy. Oh, All right. Yeah. The Skyward. Yeah, this is a cool one. I love the art and everything. So this is just really good and limited back in the yeah, day. That was an amazing limited card. Who are you? Sceptering? I missed it. I, I touched I bonked Richard in the head with oh. his family sept uh Mirror Crusader. Alright. Oh, that's a real no. That's uh protection from black, I see. <laughs> I don't know if I have any wrath left. <laughs> don't worry. I have zero wrath. <laughs> the only wrath left is just killing Richard, I guess. <laughs> oh, my skeletons, they'll 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 get the job done. Uh I really wanted to suspend this thing, but uh, I don't know if we're going to have time for this. No, the game's going to go another three turns. Don't worry. No one's dying. <laughs> the whole reason I wanted to play this deck is Tom played this card. I'm like, wow, that's so cool. Yeah, There's was... so much text on this card, though. I know. I Can you imagine being person. a new player and, and opening this card up and just being like, no, nah, I'm good. Magic seems too complicated. <laughs> I can imagine all of Time Spiral was pretty much that for like new players. Like, wait, isn't isn't green not supposed to have harmonize? Isn't this what? I don't. Didn't you say this is the creature color? I don't understand any of this. How much mana do you have, Seth? Can you just one shot me? <laughs> you can, uh, right? I don't think so. 7, 10, 11, 12, 13, 43. Uh -huh. No, I think it's low 20s, maybe 22 ish. Hmm. How in risk am I of dying? <laughs> for, for me, no. <laughs> I just like to put it out there. There's at least 90 words on Rift Mark Knight. Just putting it out there. You just counted that? That's 95, 96, 96 words, not including numbers on it. Oh my goodness. Like, that's a bit much. I'm uh, impressed. How did he do that fast? Did you do like copy paste from Gatherer? Or did you? Uh, wait, why can't I soul bond? Oh, wait. I just counted by fives. Awesome. Okay, these knights are... <laughs> <laughs> they keep coming. This bestiary, man, it's a real card. He just yeah. doesn't run out of gas. Mm -hmm. He doesn't draw lands anymore. Still five, yeah. Good old Pokedex. It does what it needs to do. <laughs> All right, one, two... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, we might as well just cast this guy. I'm so jealous oh, of Lord. the white decks <laughs> card draw. This is insanity. Not a lot of skull related card draw effects. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you Got talking about my creatures? Got him! <laughs> One down. Uh, four to yeah. go. And uh, I guess Nick goes now. Oh, okay. <laughs> And and Amiria is online, yeah, yeah. Amiria is not online, is she? Oh, it is. Yeah. It is. Uh. Make them all zero zeros. Play <laughs> <some> spells. <laughs> yeah, this doesn't really do much. All right, we might as well. We might as well, right? Everyone's gonna try to kill me anyway. We'll go out with the bang. We'll go out with the bang. Oh dear. Wait. How do I do this? Nothing can attack, right? No. This is all summoning six. Oh, so okay. This is all summoning six. So you're going to have a wrath or you're not going to have a wrath. <laughs> oh, what's one of those? Huh. Right? Yeah. Okay, I see. Oh, is this a multi-kicker thing? Three. How many multi-kickers do I need here? Oh, that's what it is. One, two, three, four. Four? No. Oh, wait, no. Five. Uh, the, the graveyard keeps minimizing. Six. Seven. Eight. Oh, right. boy. Oh. All right, not eight. Uh, this is an, okay. impressive, an impressive last stand. They're going to get Wrath, but it's okay. We'll just uh, play all of our dudes out. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's it? 
Uh, oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> if only I had haste, this would have been epic, but I don't have haste. That would so have been we'll just... at least two people dead. We'll just do this. And then hope Seth doesn't wrap me. Uh, I don't oh, have a wrath in hand. Can you activate that sanitarium. that sanitarium real quick? Sanitarium? There's a day uh, of judgment in this deck. Sure. <laughs> uh, Tom, I think you're mistaken. There was no day of judgment in my family's history. <laughs> <laughs> uh, if you give me priority... Oh. All right. Next time I get priority, I will. Also, they're all indestructible because they're not exemplar, so that's the thing. Oh. Shh, no, <laughs> don't tell him that. So we're looking for <laughs> mass exile? I have no idea. You have that, right? Is there uh, mass mass exile? In, is there a final judgment in the history of... Uh... <laughs> okay. Oh, no, it's not to draw so nope, many cards, though. All right, I don't, have, I don't have an out, by the way. I think... I think I really got to find a way to kill Richard. Oh, or, or how much mana? I don't do think I, I can though. Take. How much mana do I need? A lot. Uh, like thirty-ish. Eh. Twenty-nine. Uh, and the I gauntlets guess. exiled. Bonk. <laughs> <laughs> Tom just helped you. <laughs> Every little bit counts. I mean, the, yep. the chilling phase. Like getting in combat phase. What am I doing? One second. Well, if you can make Erebos a creature, I can make it a seven, cre a seven power creature, and you can key it. But he has a lot of so blockers. If you, get, if you can get one black pip. Oh, yeah. That's, that's oh. true, actually. Erebos right? is yeah. seven power. Mm. And, then and the swamp key it, block. And then flying and swamp block. Hmm. Aha! Mm -hmm. And pass. <laughs> That's all I got. Return to me, Sanatorium Skeleton. <laughs> Excellent. I'm trying to think, is there something Tomer can bring back from the graveyard that does anything productive? Uh, I'm going to find out right now, actually, because I have a thing that gets stuff back from the graveyard. Um, I have a skeleton. I have Bone Dancer does not do it. Boneyard Worm does not do it. Fleshbag Marauder it's, it does not help. Sifter of Skulls doesn't help. Yeah, it's... Uh, eh. mm. Not much going on. Not much. Alright, let's see how much mana I can produce. Oh, wait, let me play my land. Because that's all I draw. Uh, I have enough. She's back. Okay. And then you can get back your flesh bag marauder <laughs> and get rid of a knight? <laughs> no, because that's... I don't think I would really probably do anything anyway. Just... That would just hurt Seth the most, actually. Yeah. Well, this well, killing shade it's gonna, isn't yeah. doing much. It's minus one damage, and then it, it, it hurts Tom the most, but I don't really want to hurt Tom right now. Oh, <laughs> thanks. I know. I Remember got when you. Tom it, said it, he's going to kill you because I know, but happened. we got over that. We got <laughs> yeah, over we that. Yeah, we did get that. That's in the past. Yeah, we worked, we worked out those feelings, and uh, I don't think this is benefit. Like, if I kill one of Richard's creatures does that benefit anything I, I, no not really i guess the only thing of value in my deck is i could get oh oh maybe i get the death right shaman does that i can start no maybe mm, maybe i think it's better than it's probably your best card yeah it's sad it's sad but true <laughs> You you can chip down whoever's surviving. <laughs> sure. <laughs> uh, the other thing is, if I kill Richard, then you guys kill me, and do I really come out ahead? Oh, I'm not killing you. If you, you. kill Richard, I'm not killing you. Oh, that's... Are you going to agree to that, Tober? 
<laughs> yeah, stay of execution of at least a turn. Also, I have a 2 2 double striker. I can't do anything. I agree. I'm only at 14, though. That's not that much life. Let's see. I think I might be able to do it for a really funny reason that I didn't think of earlier. So, 14, 23, Ooh. 24, 25, 26. 26. But that Seven, one doesn't go through the shades. So I could pump that uh, 23 would be Seth, 24. Let's be are you, are you, Don't you're do one, it. You're one damage <laughs> short. Isn't that true? Richard doesn't have a flyer, right? He doesn't. Oh, man. This is so sweet. I'm sorry, Richard, that this is the way it has exactly. to go. But Exactsies. you will never guess the reason why I'm going to win. There was a purpose to this madness the whole time. <laughs> what? Oh, Golgari. Oh. And you can give it invasion. Yep. Yep. <laughs> that is funny. Oh. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> the, the troll gets there. The troll gets there in the end. The trolls in shades. I think it's like one a- skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it was there just to keep it away from Tomer, <laughs> but it's actually going to kill someone. Wow. Uh, let me just always yield to that. There we go. Yeah, yeah, I'm just F6ing right now. <laughs> Can I have oh, six? Man. Oh, wait, you gotta, yeah, I'm yeah not... I guess I, I can't actually have six. Good point. You're not gonna now I can. There we go. Why? Good job, me. Why? I don't know. Why couldn't you have F6? I'm so confused. No. I wanted to use my crown. Ah, oh. fine. Well, your crown, really. Your family's crown. Can I have six? Is anything bad going to happen to me this turn? I don't... I mean, he's, he said he's killing Richard. If he doesn't, there's nothing I can do about it now. <laughs> Sad, you're not attacking me too, yeah? Oh, man. It would be really funny just to hear the YouTube comments if I did all this and then just swung everything at you <laughs> and then, instead. And there's like... <laughs> just let Richard like, win the game automatically. And Richard won, yeah. Hey... <laughs> Oh man, that's actually tempting, but no. I, <laughs> I also feel bad because it's Richard Week, I, but <laughs> isn't that how how Jake Week ended too? He I think so, probably. Well, that's fitting <laughs> but that, for Jake. But that's week. the Jake thing. Yeah, that's true. Richard's thing is, yeah. Oh, sorry, Richard. GG. Oh, that Erebus is game. so deadly. Have a happy Richard <laughs> Week. It killed my life gain. Otherwise, I would have survived. Oh, my goodness. That was unexpected. The Grave Troll. Good job, Grave Troll. Good job. Come back to me, Grave Troll. (laughs) Oh, I have this card in this deck. (laughs) Sweet. All right, first things first. Uh One moment. Uh Can you cast enough? Oh, pass, G. Me? What? I don't. Dad. What? You could actually kill Seth? I said I wasn't, and uh, again. <laughs> I could you have actually killed me? Yeah, I could have actually killed you, but I'm not going to because I'm not a terrible person. Oh. You killed, oh. You killed Richard. I can't that's kill you a, this turn. That's true. And then this way I get to kill Tomer, and then you can kill me after that, and that's even better for you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a second, is that a real thing? Hold you up. You kill Tom first, <laughs> and then Tomer just waddles around. Just just kill his bird. Uh, that's probably <laughs> true. That that does make sense, now that you say it that way. Okay. What's going so... on? <laughs> They're conspiring against you. Pretty much. <laughs> I don't like this. We're friends, Tomer. Don't worry about it. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Okay. <laughs> Uh, Whoa. yeah, that's, that's gonna do it. I don't Your have, skeletons? Uh... Yeah, my Could skeletons. regenerating? Skeletons are fine. What's actually? that gonna do? That does nothing, right? It wipes the board if it's five or It gets rid of the shades, actually. Yeah, but he has a vat. Yeah, but the shades are gone. That's true. I mean, Tomer's still good, right? Seth, if you, oh, take, yeah, if you take the, if you take the Swamp Walk shade, oh, you can't kill him. Yeah, he has so much life. All right, how do you, how do we survive? I don't have a board wipe in hand. I don't have anything I will, relevant. I'll <laughs> give you back your grave troll. Your your, uh, your <laughs> skeletons can block regenerate the soldiers. Don't worry. 
<laughs> yeah, you're yeah. Not, you're actually the most fine in this situation. Until he finds you might a actually pump be able effect. To, to kill Seth before he like I don't know gains infinite life. Um. Uh, is that the, nope? Not chilling. Not that one. There we go. Okay. All right. I think I've been playing this well. I'm pretty happy with myself there. <gasps> Replacement effect. Oh. Grave troll, you're back. Yeah. <laughs> oh, champion of stray souls. Oh, champion of stray souls. What does it? No. <laughs> He's pretty good with the sanitarium skeleton guy. Yeah. I think. I'm not sure. Uh. Huh. Oh, can I just play it back? Oh. Oh, I could put it on top of my library. Oh, that's not as good. If I had a haste enabler, it would be pretty sweet, actually. I think the best bet is to just go for Marin again. And then I'm not sure what the follow-up is, unfortunately. Oh, my God. 16 to cast, by the way. 16 to cast. Chump, <laughs> chump change. It's getting up there. It's worth every penny. Boom. Marin is it back. Is it was only six lands for you. <laughs> uh, all right. Uh, so I can. I can. I feel like this is still not worth anything. Um, I guess I'll make another blocker. At least one. <laughs> Boom. Oh, no. It's a good thing. Oh. There we go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, that's a big boy. Yeah, that's a boy. pretty lethal looking board. When you're at 13. <laughs> I don't really want to swing the Marin at you right now. Uh, I want my blockers because I'm really afraid of just like a random pump effect with the seven soldiers. You, you know there's the the double strike. How can it be a richer deck without the double strike? Yeah, I know, I know, I know it's in there. I don't the last know if card. it's gonna kill me or not. I don't think attacking Seth is beneficial. I could do five damage and that's it. Hold everything else back. Uh, YouTube comments are gonna be angry either way. I'm gonna pass. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, everyone. <laughs> Oh, what do I bring back? Oh yeah, Champion History Soul. Super How were you gonna kill me last turn, Tom? Is it a secret? <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm actually gonna keep that one under the, under the vest if that's okay. Uh, Where are you getting just... this and draw cards? Does that mean you can just kill me again next turn if you feel like it? Uh, no, not from this position, not at all. Mm. Got to be tapped out without blockers. That's not happening anytime soon. Oh, I see. All right, I'm going to go for champion. The champ. Well, you know, I can't resist. <laughs> oh, it's, hmm. coming. it's coming to the bitter end. I can feel it. Yep, we're getting there. It's, I, I'm fine with that. It's It's been two hours, I think. I think. Some games have to end. Do you is want it... yours to end right, right now? No. I'm just yes, saying. It, it sounds like he's really interested in the game ending. I, you currently have lethal I on him. I want to win. What? Just go With for it. Lethal on me for what? What? Yeah, oh. I'm looking at lethal right now. I think How? I can shade the, lethal the you. Same way. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> but Seth, same way he killed gonna, Richard. You're going to immediately <laughs> die. To That's my concern. Do I just die to Tom? Because I have no blockers and no... If you have exactly one blocker, I can't kill you. I won't. I oh. won't. I'll kill you last. I promise. Oh wow! Look, I don't, you hear oh, this guy a, over that's, here. That's the mo Hey, I've never broken my my promise, right? Ah, uh, I think I. Get <laughs> it's true. It's also. I mean, if you don't go for it now, I can tap down the creature from like now until the end of time. That's true. Plus, it's. I mean, it's more fun this way. 
I think I can do it in a way where we both I die. also have a blocker. There you go. What? You're still killing me? What? Well, but then I get a blocker so I don't just die. So, yep. uh... Oh, do I have any outs to that? I don't think so. Hmm. So click there. What's the best shade? Man, they're all pretty bad. There's no lifelink shade? Nope. Tell me in the history of magic they never made a lifelink shade. Aw, oh, man, I should have attacked Seth for, for damage. <laughs> I didn't expect then this. I... Oh, that is so cruel. <laughs> oh, man, that's so fancy. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Oh, no. <laughs> that's all I got. <laughs> Good game. Good game. All right, there's now a flying 2 2 Nightwing shade in play. Howdy. This is going to be like the Double first scepter shade, of Empire's victory. Watch. <laughs> oh, I forgot about. Oh, yeah, actually, yeah, never mind. You're dead. I forgot about scepter. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> oh, I should have known this would happen. I told you it would happen. I should have listened. You never <laughs> listen. Well, it's a single of distinction. <laughs> that, oh, that's how I'm going to die? Yeah. Oh, oh, a Laura, a Laura limited champion single of distinction. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. That's embarrassing. <laughs> 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yep, this should work. Bam. Madness. Really worried about <laughs> snuff out right now, not gonna lie. <laughs> uh, no, no snuff out. Got and him. the scepter of Richard's family wins the game. Oh, <laughs> scepter right. Empire's good, game. Win. good game. That was, was nitty-gritty at the end. Crazy. Did you just top deck the sigil? Yep. No, no, no. I had the sigil. Oh, I yeah. could have killed him with the uh, with the double striker last turn, but I didn't. Mm. And then Got to hear. Makes sense. So that was It'll... a long game, but I think a very good one, too. Because <laughs> there was a lot of back and forth there. So, Seth, what what was the the, the secret plans of the Shades? Or, or was just pumping them up and giving them evasion kind of kind of the, the main shtick and the only shtick? Uh, that, that was pretty much it. Dub as many ways as possible to kind of <laughs> double up my mana and then every shade I think even down to the ones that I couldn't pump which we saw in that game the snow pumping sh uh, shade and yeah ways to make them unblockable and that was pretty much the only thing my deck really could do other than draw cards of course and wrap the board <laughs> over and over again uh, but it kind of worked like it, it was definitely janky but it was sort of competitive the combo of uh swamp walk and urborg was definitely key i think if it wasn't for that it would have been a lot harder eventually i drew into the key to the city which kind of worked the same way to make things unblockable but without making the shades unblockable they're really bad because you spend your entire turn pumping them and they just get chumped so you really got to have the ways to make them unblockable to have any realistic shot of it working yeah, but at the late game with Cabal Coffers and Urborg uncontested and all that mana, it seemed like a, a pretty good strategy to have so many board wipes just to get you to the late game where your shades can get huge. So it was it seemed like a, a nice synergistic deck in that way, even though there's no like specific keywords that are helping specifically shades or anything. You just had all these different elements that kind of worked. So I really liked it. The only thing I wish is that they would print an actual shade with the shade ability as a legend. That's the one thing that, I mean, Ishin <laughs> yeah. Shade was fine, and it is a shade, but it doesn't feel like a shade because you can't pump it. So maybe someday they'll give us a legendary shade for this deck. Yeah, I think shades are popular enough. They keep showing up as limited staples. It makes sense that we get a legendary shade at some point that pumps itself. So. I'm surprised that uh, I had, oh, where is it? Narcana Revenant, Ooh. which is a vampire shade that also doubles your mana, but it's not a legend. It feels like it could be. It's mythic. It's like a six drop, but it's not legendary for some reason. So something like that that would be a legend would be perfect for this deck. 
Yeah, it would be perfect for Commander in general. I think a lot of people would like that. Well, that was a sweet deck. Uh, Tom, so we got to hear mm -hmm. the legend of Richard as told through chivalry and knighthood, going to the throne eventually, having the crown placed on his head. Were there any other untold stories, however, of, of Sir Richard that you wish to have shown off but you didn't this game? Oh my god. Um, <laughs> all right. So I'm gonna. I'm just gonna restrict myself. I, I will say one of my favorite parts about building this deck was for some reason I thought Purity was legendary. So that was gonna be the legend for the deck, actually. <laughs> Turns out Purity, not a legendary creature, just a six mana, six six flying rare from Lorwyn. Uh, but it has Purity, Glory, and Valor uh, for the incarnation triple threat, which I thought was pretty awesome. Um, <laughs> and then, of course, I, I got to pull off one of my favorite combos, which was actually Celestial Mantle uh, on the, um, the combos is a terrible word for this. Uh, one of my favorite combinations of cards, uh, which is Celestial Mantle on the Flash Flyer. I can't find him. Uh, on the Celestial Crusader, mm. uh, which was, of course, uh, Richard's ancestors wearing uh, Richard's ancestors, ancestors plate mail to go in <laughs> for the game, which I love to death. I'm, I'm so happy I got to do that. Yeah, I will really say cool. there's a Bridget Hero of Kinsbale in here, uh, which is, of course, uh, Richard's first lieutenant, as well as his two different masters when he was growing up, the Serene Master and Odric Master Tactician. Uh, let's just say this deck goes very deep. Um, definitely check out the deck list. It's hilarious and also super cheap. And uh, I, I really had a lot of fun building this deck. And it took me about four hours to build this deck because I was literally <laughs> scrolling through all of the white and colorless cards and being like, I guess this works. <laughs> it was... It's uh, really fine, the heroic ones. It's not like you could just type in like a keyword like chivalry yeah, no. <laughs> that's really cool and a very unique take take mm -hmm. on uh edh deck where you're telling a story through the cards as opposed to just building a tribe or building a mechanic you're building a story so that was really that was something i haven't actually seen before in play so i i, I thought that was a treat and very fitting was, of legends yeah. his uh, there was Richard's also history. Yeah, there was Richard's Noble Steed, also known as the Revered Unicorn, <laughs> uh, which is a random uncommon from Weatherlight, which is a unicorn. And then there's also Rule of Law in this deck, because you have to abide by the Rule of Law. But yeah, this deck was really fun. I'm glad it actually magically won, and uh, I got, I'm glad I got to show off the, the true untold story of Richard's, of Richard's history and his family. Yeah, it was really cool. All right, and I'm going to just quickly tell the story of my deck, which is, it wasn't a skeleton tribal deck. I, w I wasn't actually trying to build that, but I did try to build a deck that was all about skeletons in the name, in the subtype, in the artwork, or just reference somehow. And I, I think I accomplished it, and I was really happy with the list in the end. It was actually quite cheap. Um, it was about 18 tickets online which is, you know, the usual budget, and I, I, like, put some good cards, but then I made two last-minute additions. Uh, two cards in the deck combined are, they're both actually 30 tickets each online. Marin of Clan Neltoth, which I chose specifically because the deck is so hurting on card advantage. The best card in the deck by far is Skull Clamp, and I think, in hindsight, I probably should have taken the Skull Clamp as an early drop, um, and I got Greedy instead, and I got Cabal Coffers. But Skull Clamp takes all these 1-1 one, one Dredge Skeletons and turns them into more cards, and then hopefully you can find good cards through that. And I think that was probably would have been the best bet. Um, the other card is Batter, Batter Skull, which was also in um, Richard's original deck list. And it's a $30 card because it sees modern play and whatnot. Um, so other than that, it's just all Skeletons. I liked the fact that they were so resilient to board wipes. There weren't a lot of board wipes available <laughs> to to the deck that were skeleton related, but I did find Extinction, and I was really happy about that because I knew Richard Tribal means or Richard Week means people are going to be playing Tribal decks, and Extinction says destroy all creatures of any creature type of your choice. So it's a one sided board wipe. You just I could have like nuked all the knights or nuked all the shades or whatever. Unfortunately, I dredged it, but whatever. Um, there was just a lot of cool cards. I didn't have too many good 
uh, finishers, but I did have exoskeletal armor. Enchanted creature gets plus X plus X, where X is the number of creature cards in all graveyards. Very good on 1-1 one, one regenerates, just because they have a lot of resiliency. Same thing with Bone Horde. Same thing with Grafted Exoskeleton, except not so much because my creatures are small. Uh, my favorite card in the, in the entire deck is definitely Skull Catapult. <laughs> it's a four mana artifact. You could pay one, tap it, sacrifice a creature. Skull Catapult deals two damage to target creature or player. And it has an amazing art. So I really like the deck. It's super flavorful. Uh, I had tons of fun with it. I got to do puns. This, it was a blast for me. I really, really enjoyed this game in particular. Um, all right. So last but not least, Richard. You came out with the knights. We've never seen the knights before. You did good. <laughs> And was was there any cool stuff that you didn't get to show off? And what was like the the decks other other synergies going on? How did you get around building? Yeah, so the whole point of the deck was to use uh, Cedar Condo's ability. Basically, creatures with power two or less they can't be blocked except with uh, flyers and reach. So you attack with all your weenies, and then I have a whole bunch of instant speed team pumps. So white has a lot of effects where it gives your team plus two plus two. So basically, we just swing in there, uh, unblocked, and then pump the team and just alpha strike someone. And you kind of saw that we also had like riot, Riders of Gavini and other such effects. And uh, there was a theme of killing creatures with power four or three or more, because all my knights are, are small. So, so that was the gist of it. Uh, we saw Lifecrafter's Bestiary do, do work. That that's a uh, pretty oh, sweet. Yeah. I had like glimpse of nature on like the entire game. So much, and strength, that allowed so me cantrips. to survive a million flesh bog marauders and uh, <laughs> a million rafts from Seth. So, yeah, it's a pretty sweet deck. And uh, if you're playing against black decks, you just randomly get to hose them with all of your pro black knights. <laughs> so, so that's pretty sweet. Yeah, I liked the deck resiliency that artifact really showed its stuff being a cornerstone of the deck um, throughout the match. I really like the indestructible Night Lord. I thought that was wicked. And also the knights that gave protection on anything you chose temporarily was also yeah. a sweet thing. There were a lot of really cool knights you just don't get to see. And I like that Sidor Condor didn't specifically help knights, but because knights are all 2-2s, or the vast majority of them are all 2-2s, he works really well as like an unofficial Night Lord. I thought the deck really came together really well, and there's a lot of synergies that weren't specifically spelled out, but just seeing them play together, it really worked that well. Yeah, and you get to play uh, your favorite white card, Mentor the Meek. <laughs> yes, <laughs> So we, really we, cool. we could have totally went off with Mentor of the Meek and uh, Life Crafters Bestiary mm -hmm. <laughs> and Skull Clamp, of course. Imperial Recruiter would definitely be right on theme. Imperial Knights and stuff. Yeah, Recruiter of the Guard. Oh, that, that, that's the one. <laughs> yep. That's have that a, too. It looked, it looked like a sweet deck. So I think it comes down to the end of the season. Richard, you're going to be stepping down from the core lineup. It's going to be really sad to see you go. And hopefully somebody is going to be picking up the underdog tribes going forward because there's still a lot of, you know, not not the, the most loved tribes out there that <laughs> they, they still need love, you know? Uh, based on what I saw today, I think you guys will be fine. You <laughs> saw much love for Shades, <laughs> Skeletons, <laughs> uh, Sir Richard's royal family heritage. <laughs> we, we learned from the best, I would say. So it also doesn't mean it's going to be the end of you on Commander Clash. There's going to be more seasons. Obviously, you, you might step in at the next one. And also, there's going to be guest appearances that we're hopefully going to do more often. So if we have more guest slots, if somebody just rotates out for whatever reason, Rich is going to be joining us for those games. Um, so you're still going to see him around uh, for sure. And I'll join you guys in the comments. Time to join the YouTube <laughs> Legion and be like, Tober, why are you doing this? <laughs> oh my god, Five please minute, don't ask why we say a fate. <laughs> why did you play Fage? Why did you play Fage? <laughs> <laughs> oh, good times. And okay, so we've or just so everybody knows, um, for the next season, we've already chosen a person. Um, we're not going to reveal who it is, though. It's a mystery. But just fear not. Commander Clash will be moving on just right on schedule just with a new season a new lineup and it's going to be awesome so until then guys see ya